Good morning, everybody. It's Dave here. It's Thanksgiving week. It's the week to be grateful. Um, today, coming to you with a little, as I like to say, no excuses mindset message. I'm here outside, actually in front of my home. It is like 30 something degrees. I just finished a, like a four and a half mile run. I tried running my route if you ever exercise and you run, try doing the route in reverse. I never realized how hard it was going the other way. But I came to you, I'm coming to you this morning because I want to talk to you guys about something that, you know, really struck me when I read it, um, when I saw it myself, also heard about it. And I want something for you guys um, to think about with your life. And that is when you go to a graveyard, when you go to a cemetery, you see everybody's date they were born, you see the little dash, and then you see the date that they passed away. And that little dash right there inside is what you do with your life in the time you are on this earth. It is all the things that you accomplished or all the goals and ideas or dreams and actions that you don't in fact go after. And my question to you is, what is your dash? What is the mark? you're gonna leave on this earth. You know, I, I have heard that, you know, life today, you can kind of coast through life. Think about it, most of us wake up, we have a roof over our heads, we have food in our refrigerator. If we're struggling with finances or going through a tough time, we have friends and family that can pick it up. We're not fighting for food to live like hundreds of years ago that they used to do in shelter. Like we can kind of coast through life, right? Life's kind of simple. But the thing is, is that if you want to achieve something and you want to accomplish something, you are going to face resistance. And we have to understand that, you know, not every chapter in our life, not every part of that dash in our life is going to be easy, but it will be worth it, right? Struggle is less painful than regret. And the thing is, is when that little dash is there, what is what you're, what are you going to do with that dash? You know, I took, I did simple math, you know, say the average person lives to about 75 years old, it's 365 days in a year. That's about 27,375 days we're on this earth. 27,375 days on this earth, or each day we have 86,400 seconds in a day. Every second that goes by is a second we won't get back, right? What we do, Yesterday doesn't matter. What we want to do tomorrow doesn't matter. It's what we do today that matters. And I need you to understand to not worry about tomorrow, to not worry about today, but realize that our clock is ticking on this earth. Our dash is getting smaller and smaller from the 27,375 average days on this earth. And every day it goes down by one. And when we wait for things to be convenient and we wait for things to be perfect and we wait for things just to be less right, less busy, no pandemic, no election, our kids are older, our kids have moved out of the house, our kids aren't babies anymore, whatever, we're constantly waiting. We're gonna be waiting for the rest of our life. And then when we have our end on date, people aren't gonna remember us for the money that we had or anything like that. We're, they're gonna remember for the impact and the legacy and the mark that we made on this earth. So my question to you is, are you just kind of coasting through life in that dash? Or are you going after it and understanding that there is going to be resistance and we need to push through? Guys, I just want uh, for something for you guys to understand is just to remember that little piece of that dash and to ask yourself every single day, what am I doing with that dash, dash as the time is going by each and every day? So, you know, for me, I could tell you right now, Kristen and I have achieved something great, but trying to get to another level is, is the resistance of what we want to do to get there. But the thing is, I'm not going to accept where we are. We have to always be willing to push ourselves to the next level. So that's my message for you guys today on this Wednesday. Um, be grateful. It's Thanksgiving week for people here in the United States. Be grateful for what we have, but don't sell yourself short. Don't play a small game in your life. And if you're struggling right now, remember this may be a page in your life. This may be a chapter in your life, but it's not the book of your life. You still have time. Guys, please share this message. Comment below. If it was a value to you, like the message, tag a friend, whatever you can do, because I always say I help people to break through their fear and adversity to play a bigger game in their business and their life in every area that they make an impact. Guys, have a great Wednesday and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.